Alright, what's up y'all? It's Drew Love. I'm here with DMV Access. I'm here with my man Sam the Man. Uh, why don't you tell me a little bit about yourself? Where you come from, man? Alright, um, I'm from Alexandria, Virginia. Uh, 16, producing and rapping. Uh, trying to, you know, make it out here, man. El Chubo G, you feel me? Life's good. God is great. Uh, released five tapes in the past year. All good stuff. Check them out there on that Piff, Spin Roller, all that good stuff. Uh, why don't you tell me about, like, maybe some of your musical influences? Like, if you if you could name three people that influence you the most in your music and what you do, uh, who would they be? All right. Uh, very cliche, but uh, Drake, Kanye, and, and Jay, most definitely. Why would you say it? Explain one of those. Explain Drake. Why do you think Drake influences you, man? Um, oh, it's like raw, it's raw emotion, you know what I'm saying? It might come off like, you know, a little feminine or sweet. You know, some people might say that, but it's raw emotion. I'm all for the truth. So I like, I, th I think honesty sells. Uh, when did you start doing this? Like, when did you start doing music? Oh, shoot. Um, started doing music. I've always had like a musical history background. I've been playing, you know, instruments all my life, trumpet, first chair and stuff like that. I got into rap music just as an outlet for a hobby, then became a passion. I've been rapping for about a year and a half or so like that, and I released my first tape in December 1st of 2012, so. Okay, that's respectable. Um, so uh, what do you stand for? Like, what do you what do you think the, the biggest message that comes across in your music is? Like, what do you stand for the most? Um, well, I already stated L Triple G, you know, life is good, God is great, that's my imprint. Shoot, man, peace, positivity, and prosperity, man. The three Ps, you feel me? All right, so what do you think makes you a little bit different than some of these artists that you out here? Like, you know what I'm saying? Some of the DMV artists that you hear on a regular basis, what makes you what stand, makes you stand out, you know, amongst the, the rest of them? Oh, most definitely. Um, well, I always, I have a teenage outlook on life, so I'm not really, like, into guns or, like, sex and stuff, because, you feel me? Uh, I mean, yeah, it was straight up, you know what I'm saying? It's just real, real life, you know what I'm saying? I try to just keep it real, always. Uh, well, so tell me, like, maybe about some of your past projects or something you got coming up. What do you want people to know about right now? Um, all right, cool. I just released a, a EP, Fear EP. It's actually an EP with its 13 tracks. Uh, December 25th, I released it on Christmas of 2013. It's on spinrilla.com. Uh, shoot, man, find me on Twitter at the OG Flare. I got a tape coming up with some some big stuff, big production, and everything like that, and around October, so next fall. It's pretty respectable. Uh, so if you could say there's one thing that happened in your life maybe that really made you think that you had to start doing music or what made you really decide that you wanted to do this um like like around the time like I actually started getting called Sam the man like it was no longer Samuel around my way or at my school or my community it was actually like yo Sam the man was you know was good with you and stuff like that I was like all right yeah yeah it's, it's real yeah it's real okay okay that's respectable um so if you could say like you know what I'm saying um when you started doing music originally uh, when you started originally doing music, um, who was the, who were the first people that you really started doing music in front of? Like who who really ins who really told you that you you know had a future in that, or did you be just believe in yourself? Um, I've I've been a confident person for a while, but my family they're my number one supporters. Like if I'm laying a track down and I actually play it in my like my uh, my studio, I have a couple studios. Once in my crib, like I actually call my mom, my sister, and my pops to come in and be like, "Yo, you know, check this out. How do you like this?" So it's a it's a free environment in my home. My family's my number one supporters. They'd be like, oh, that's good. They'd be like, oh, you know, fix this, tweak that, don't put that out. You know, so it's, it's great. I always come from my family with that, so definitely in front of them. That's always a good thing when you have family and everybody that's, that's behind you and things like that. Um, so do you do you play any instruments? You know what I'm saying? Do you have any, do you do anything else other than rap? Do you make beats? What do you do? Yeah, um, producer, man. Get at me for beats. Uh, yo, at the OG Flare, you can hit my email, beamanproductions at gmail.com. Yo, I don't mind getting my information out. It's all, you know, you can find me anywhere, man. Uh, anything you need. Verses, features, videos, everything like that. And there you have it. Hit up Sam the Man right here, y'all. DMV Access. This is Drew Love.